Skinny Love is uh, kind of an easy song to learn, sort of an intermediate song. Uh, it's mostly three chords with a couple of two chord change-ups, okay? So it sort of sounds like this, the beginning part sounds like this. Come on, Skinny Love, and last a year. Something like that. Uh, yeah, so that's the first part. I'll just show you that part and then we'll move on. That part is the second part. All right, so the first part is just a C sharp minor. So. And in my left hand, I'm playing C sharp, G sharp, and C sharp. If you can't reach all these notes for anything I'm teaching here, just take out whatever you can't reach. It'll still sound pretty good. Okay? So you get basically C sharps in your left hand. You can add a G sharp if you want. In your right hand, you've got E, G sharp, C sharp, and another E if you can, e if you can reach it. Come on, skinny love. Love is, uh, you're gonna move to an A major. So in your left hand, you move to A's. In your right hand, you've got E, A, C sharp, and another E if you can reach it. So the first two, C sharp minor. Come on, skinny love. A, and let and last a year. On here, you're gonna move to an E. So that's just an E, a B, and an E in your left hand. A G sharp, a B, and an E in your right hand. And that's pretty much it. Those are the first three chords of that uh, part. You sort of loop it back again, so you start over. C sharp minor, A, E. This. Ma, ma, ma. Same thing, C sharp minor. Ma, 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 ma. Okay, so it's basically three loops of that, of that part that I showed you, okay? Then it moves into uh, this part that sounds like, sounds like this. And I don't know the lyrics, but. Da, 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 da. So it sort of goes from that part and it jumps right back into that first part that I showed you. So that little weird little sort of, I don't know, transition part is an F sharp minor. So F sharp, C sharp, F sharp in your left hand, if you can reach all that. An A, a C sharp, and an F sharp in your right hand. And then you jump back to this C sharp minor, like the first chord you played, remember? So C sharp, G sharp, excuse me, C sharp. E, G sharp, C sharp, and E. Okay? Now the little... Uh, nah, 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 nah. That little walk down, it starts with on an E, and you're just going to play D sharp, C sharp, B, and then you're going to jump back into the, to that first loop and play through again. Dressing it up, but don't worry about that for now, okay? All right, so anyway, you're gonna play through that a couple times. You're gonna have to use your ears to know when to change. And you move to this, that second part I should do. F sharp minor, C sharp minor. And then there's this part that's like, told you to be patient. And that loop is really pretty simple. It's just an E major chord to start, to start with. So E, B, and E with your left hand. G sharp, B, and E with your right hand. Hope you can see all that. And you can move to a G sharp minor. So G sharp, D sharp, G sharp in your left hand. B, D sharp, and G sharp in your right hand. Uh, if you're sort of an advanced piano player, you'll notice I'm playing these on the root inversions. If you don't know what that means, forget about it. But uh, I'm doing that. I usually don't do that, but I think it sounds better in this case. That's why I'm doing it. So that last chord, anyway, is a C sharp minor. So C sharp, G sharp, C sharp. And you've got E, G sharp, and C sharp. So those are all the parts. Those three parts make up the whole song. You just sort of have to know where to drop them in, okay? There's a part where, towards the end, it sort of re uh, repeats that a little bit higher. I don't even know if this is on the camera anymore, but it repeats that part higher. I think 
it does it twice. I'll put it low just in case you can't see it. And that's, that's how it ends. So it's actually pretty simple if you slow down and learn those parts. Go back and listen to the original so you know where it drops in and you'll be good. All right? I hope this uh, tutorial helped you. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.